hiking up Logan Pass. Okay guys, so I haven't had much chance to talk at all. Today's been crazy. But basically, we are hiking up Logan Pass. Hopefully we'll make it to the lookout in time. Um, we're here for sunset on a wilderness photography workshop. So leaving the overlook, heading back down. I'm so thirsty. I have my water bottle in my pack. Too lazy. I could literally drink like five swimming pools of clean drinking water. Never have that when you're just so thirsty. Oh, here, a little hair frizz. It's such a different feel than just regular vacations with your family because I'm home at a workshop with people I met a couple days ago, some today. I can tell it's already getting chillier. So, this is it. It's time for bed. It's gonna get very, very cold tonight. And I'm kind of scared, but I think I'm well prepared. So, good night. So we just went to St. Mary's Falls and it is so beautiful, it's still back there. Um, the fall colors, like the brush and stuff, the forest floor is gorgeous, so beautiful. I think now we're going to get coffee and something to eat at a little coffee shop. So. Okay, so I know this is bad lighting, but I can't help it. Basically, we went and saw sunrise, but it was very foggy, so there's no color. And then we hiked to this waterfall that you saw. Fall colors were gorgeous. Then we came back, had a late, late breakfast, had a PowerPoint lecture, and... I'm using the bathroom, packed my lunch, and then we're headed to Manning Glacier. So we are now by Many Glacier, hiking to a falls and maybe a lake, depending on how far. But I'm very hot. I've only had fruit snacks and apple and Belvita bites all day. I have a really bad headache, so. So we are at Mini Glacier Lodge right now, and I can see on the lake it's starting to rain. Um, we're staying here until sunset, so dark. Basically, we saw a moose at Red Rock Lake. It was pretty far away, so basically we just got, we zoomed in, tried to get the best image that we could. But it was still neat that we saw a moose. Um, and then on the way, kind of by Bab, we saw a very blonde slash silver grizzly bear in the bushes right on the side of the road. It was a bear jam. We didn't stop though, but still got a good view of him. 
um, like I said, he was very blonde and he was like sitting down so I could only see like his shoulders up and he was in the bushes chowing down so <sighs> it was like for a split second but I have that image in my mind so I'm happy with that. And then later on when we got back from our hike someone's like oh look at all the bears like where and it was up on like a mountain like over there not that same mountain but like the distance and they were tiny little dots but it still counts maybe i don't know that's kind of the wildlife we saw today so far like bighorn sheep elk grizzly moose those are kind of the big ones i guess so yeah guys this is literally too beautiful So I don't think we'll have any color for sunset. We've been kinda missing out. Like this morning, there was so much fog, no color. This evening, clouds and fog. So still have like an hour until sunset, but I've been already wandering around for an hour by myself. So I wanna see how it looks from this angle. take a picture of myself because obviously I'm not with anyone to take a picture of me but this guy saw me and he asked me he's like are you trying to take a picture of yourself so I was like trying to position it and look and it wasn't working I'm just like yeah and he like offered to take my picture like what a kind person he just like completely went out of his way and like was bothersome and was like let me take out my jacket for this one and he even took a panorama of me like dude thank you vigorously shaking throughout the night like it was last night. If I have to, I'm wearing this jacket to bed. So we are at our spot for sunrise and I can hear elk bugling in the background. And another foggy morning. Last night we had dinner at a restaurant. It was so crazy but so cool in there. And the food was so good. Slept a lot better last night. I was a ton warmer. I had on like six layers, so. so we went to a coffee shop, got some hot chocolate, bought my mom and dad a present. And I think I got windburn on my cheeks because they're really hot and feels like a sunburn. We are now headed to some more waterfalls. So we were going to the gorge and it had been pretty cloudy and then a huge thunderstorm, really loud thunder, and it started raining and then hail. And so we retreated underneath this really cool bridge, got some photos. Rocks are super slippery, the path is slippery. But now the clouds have kind of moved and you can see the mountains. So beautiful. So we found this amazing lookout. It's by the way. So We're at 
the East Glacier Lodge right now. We made it to West Glacier and we're at the Candy Center. Last stop before going home. It's so weird being here when the town is so quiet. It's like 